Hey there, this is Yvar Balot. Welcome to this video. Happy, happy new year. I'm excited to be ramping up videos again and really allowing it to be a pillar in my business for the new year. So how are you? What are you up to? What are your plans? Well, I want to share with you one of the things that you can be doing for the 2017 year for it to be epic and amazing. And it all starts with taking responsibility for your life and for your business. And so it's been one of those things where you see people who, who are succeeding. The only difference or one of the key differences is that they took full responsibility for the results that they're getting in their life, whether they're good or bad. And so if you want to you know, be a change agent in the marketplace. You got to start with yourself, examine what actually happened in the previous year, what worked, what didn't, and what onus can I put on myself? What personal responsibility can I put on myself to say, you know what, as a result of the, because of the results, I'm going to take responsibility and decide to shift and change them for the better. And so one of my favorite quotes is that it may not be your fault but it is your responsibility. Meaning that there's a lot of different things that are out of your control. There's a lot of circumstances and issues and problems and events and occurrences that happen that are completely out of your control. But how you respond to them is 1000% in your control. And so when you focus on how you can respond, not only within your character, but also how you can understand that the issue and the problem and the, the, the circumstance is serving you on some type of level. When you can you know flip it around, like Tony Robbins says, instead of having a victim mentality of, you know, why is this happening to me? You can say, why is this happening for me? You know, where's the lesson in this? Um, you know, if you're at a traffic light or if you're racing and you're, you're, you know, stuck in traffic, am I supposed to be learning patience right now? You know, am I supposed to, you know, pause right now in life? Why are these things happening to you and for you so you can actually advance yourself. You know, it's a learning lesson lesson in every aspect of your life. And so one of the things that I've noticed is that there's like three levels of responsibility that people can that people usually take on. The first, of course, is the lack of responsibility, lack of personal responsibility. They don't want to say that they did anything. They're kind of like very passive in their life whether it's good or bad, they don't want to take any level of responsibility. Then there's people who are selective with their responsibility. They're, when, when, when things are good, they're like, yes, it was me. And when things were bad, they're nowhere to be found. They're, these are people who are very selective. And then there's leaders who take full responsibility whenever things go good or bad, right? Of course, leaders want to be modest. They want to be humble when things go great. But a true leader recognizes, you know, because of my actions um, and because of the work ethic that I put in, I can say, you know, this is a because this is why I got the results that I that I got. And so I can be responsible for when things happen good and I can be responsible when things go wrong, right? Because it's my attitude that makes up the difference, my attitude on how I see things and how I can actually interpret those things for my benefit. And so this year, if you can get crystal clear on 2017 being the year of, of you being a t a intentionally responsible for every area of your life and understanding, just the key of understanding that everything is happening for your good, it can cause massive breakthroughs and shifts on every plane, every aspect of your life, everything that you're doing. And so I want you to go out, be intentional with this year. This year is about freedom. It's about being on purpose. If you want to learn more about building your business on the side, if you want to learn more about leverage and automation and really using tools and resources to make things work for you, especially if you're building your business on the side like I am. I want you to visit freedomonpurpose.com, learn about the system that I'm utilizing and it can help you do the same. Freedomonpurpose.com to the next video. See ya.